Still on leg and country coach Laurie Daly has poured water on speculation Kurt Gidley is a certain to be named New South Wales halfback. Well, I'm a selector and I don't know about any done deals, so um, uh, I'm sure uh, he's in the mix. Well, I know he's in the mix because we've discussed him, but uh, no one's across the line. Gidley has been named at fullback in the Knights squad to face the Titans on Saturday. Knights coach Brian Smith will give captain Danny Badiris every chance to play against the Titans this Saturday following Friday night's City Country Clash. Danny Wicks moves into the starting lineup to cover for country representative Ben Cross, while Jared Mullen returns at halfback. With the prospect of losing Badiris for the clash with the league leading Titans, Mullen's return is a huge boost. Following his impressive performance against the Roosters, Chris Bailey retains his place alongside Mullen in the halves. Danny Wicks moves into the starting lineup, while Matt Hilda could make an unexpected start against his former club if Badiris can't back up after Friday night. Meanwhile, the Titans are getting used to life at the top with three players selected for the city country clash. Yeah, this is going to be a real tough game for us. Uh, you know, with, with the three players alone coming back from Rep Footy, uh, that's going to be a real challenge. The Gold Coast has named a 21-man squad as insurance for LaFranchi, Minicello and Delaney. Michael Hodgson and Luke O'Dwyer will be monitored this week after both suffered minor leg injuries against the Warriors. With Mullen returning for the Knights, the battle with the informed Scott Prince will be one to watch. Both players are expected to miss out on State of Origin selection, rubbing more salt into Prince's wounds after he missed out on an Australian jersey. I think he's a bit sick of it, all of it, and I'm, I'm sick of it as well. You know, as soon as you get asked a question about it, it's, you know, of course we're disappointed. Like, he is disappointed, but selectors have got a job to do and they've done it. Unbeaten at home, the Titans will be looking to stretch their winning streak to six games. Mitchell Hughes, NBN News.